Mother simply cannot take a joke. You, stranger! I've not seen your kind before. What clan are you? They look odd. Etua invited me here to see her father. What's that on your face? It is the mark of the Sarendo. And yet the Saren, who we once knew, did not defy Ewa with scraps from the Sky People. It's all I know. They stole us when we were children. They have stolen many things. You were gone a long time. And you are young. Has your spirit been molded by the Sky People? Or do you remember the ways of your clan? Shoo! Put that away! <clears throat> Sharp eyes. A Saren whose gaze. But yours is heavy. Let home tree be a refuge from your burdens. We will put some color in your cheeks, or in your clothes at the very least. You will pick up the threads of your people here. Oh, how I miss their stories. They loved our silk harvest, the sweet smell of dye my own too. Cut not. Let me take the Saren too. The poor child knows nothing of our ways. Go. We will speak more when you are settled. Darling. With... I really must speak more with Etua's father about the resistance. Later, my Yagdu. He is our Uluk Ektan, our clan's leader. 
Let us clean you up a bit first. You would frighten the hide off an angsic looking like that. <laughs> Besides, I would not mention those sky people if I were you. They are nothing but trouble, and Katna does not like trouble. Let me Eshua show you off is a right. bit instead. The sky hmm? people are scum. Where Will you place? allow me that? It has been an age since we had Sarentu around here. Your people certainly made life more interesting. One time, they told us a tale about the rare mating rituals of the giant Zakru. Apparently, it can take days. <laughs> but there will be time for that later. Our great tree has that many stories, lived many All lives, well. hosted your ancestors as our guest before you. And there was not one Saren to who could resist how our dies dance. <laughs> Come, see my weavers. Koranu, my dear, let us see your latest. Gorgeous silk, is it not? Not as sturdy as it once was, not since the Kinglor flowers closed. But still, you will not find better. Stronger than Zakru will, I promise you that. And you know how the Zezwa love to brag. Koranu is quite the weaver. She will help you out. Anything you need. Yes, please take my mind off this. I've been working on it for hours and... It's still not quite where I want it. You see, now is the time for beauty, not this color. for art. Too dark. Speaking of which... <laughs> People need a little nudge sometimes. A little intervention for their own... Relu! Finally decided to grace me with your presence, have you? And with a Sarentu, no less. Exciting, is it not? Another lost soul for you to guide over the rocky ravines of life. Better meant to wait, Sarentu. <laughs> ah, still cross, I see. If you are smart, you will not let this one fill your head with silk and dye. The heart of the Aranae is taste. Relun is a pretty one, says they but he is the very best like cook. Me. He knows it too. And here, my dear friend, Kitangi. Nafika, taking the Sauron to under your wing already? A necessity, I should think. Look at these clothes. Pitiful. Blech. Rough and prickly like a hermit bud. You lack the grace of your ancestors. They knew how to dress. Rough and prickly is what I'm used to. Well, now you will shine brightly. Rival the rainforest with our collars, my own too. Our silk will serve you well. Strengthened with storm beast hide, it will stop you from getting chewed up out there. Or at least, you will be hard to swallow. <laughs> Storm Beast? Can this child track? I've done okay so far. Okay? What do we think of okay? Do you thrive on okay, child? Or do you only survive? Ito is on a hunt. I'm sure he will make a fine guide. <laughs> Indeed, if you can find him. There is a hunting camp near the water. E2 will be there. But do not upset his hunt. He will not thank you for that. Go on, my own two. A respectful hunt will show Katnat. You remember the ways of the people. There is no need to rush yourself, child. Go now if you want. But stay and enjoy our beautiful silk harvest if you need a little Etua rest. Is a champion. No Arana, he will we begrudge you that. Her into battle. Uh, 
I try so hard, but things so rarely turn out the way I want. Have a look then. I made it to the Arana Head. You weren't wrong about them, but one of them took me in, Nafika. She thinks I can impress Kotnat if I show him I can hunt properly. They sent you on a hunt? I should have showed you how myself. It's okay. Nafika said one of their hunters might show me how. Itu. Have you seen Vu'an? I am worried about her. Do you know where Vu'an is? She promised she would bring me dying materials, but she has been gone forever. I don't know who that is. Sorry. Uh, I cannot gather my own supplies. I... I have no Ikran. Vu'an offered to help, but what if something happened to her because of me? I can look for her if you like. Oh, could you? She likes the forage in a shaded grove. Perhaps you could ask around for her there. I hope I have something you like. Come back if you need more. Perhaps you might find use for some new equipment. I think my craftsmanship has really improved. I just hope Nafika agrees. should pass a trial of sorts before being invited to stay. If it is not perfect, then what is the point? Try to mix the nectar with a touch of shell fruit juice. Pressed, or do you grind the pulp? Always pressed. But you must find one that is very ripe, or the King Lord will not like it so much. The tiny sky people, they will wear our skin. Many branches, many roots, but one tree. An old Arana his saying that still rings true. I am sure you think God not stodgy in his traditions, but some things should not be forgotten. Care for others is to care for yourself. You miss this part of life, I know. But Ewa, 
connects us all. The Great Mother is in all things. That connection must be nurtured. Share with the clan. Care for their wants, their needs. They will notice and share with you in return. You will see. No more loneliness, child. This is what it means to be home. flowers ever reopen so long as the sky people remain of course not do you really think it is because of them i am not so sure
something tonight. I hear the viper wolves cry. should lead as Sahib, not as a warrior. You are courting trouble. We are not some brawling Zeswa. The two us should know better. Could be Itu. Ah, stop! Your Ikran is beautiful. My Zomi. For her, no wind is too strong, no challenge too great. We hunt with heart, in harmony. Are you here to admire us? I would not fault you for that. No, I... I I'm looking for Itu. My name has reached other clans. Even lost ones. Let me guess, Nafika sent you to me. <laughs> she wants me to teach. Boring, I say. To be safe at home tree, telling the little ones of hearts, of adventure. They would not understand. What does danger mean to those who have only known safety? Zome and I tear through the skies together, our hearts pounding, our senses on fire. That rush makes us strong, fearless, the best hunters. Nefika did say you were hunting Sturm Beast. Can I join? Is that what you are after? Are you a good hunter? I was never taught how. Never taught how? What have your people been doing all these years? Did you find a land without hunting? A place where creatures lay down to die willingly? See there? Young hunters practice on targets first. Practice, or it will be the stern beast hunting you. Can hit a static target at least. Come, not bad. At least your thanks will have meaning. My thanks? Are you serious? What have your people been doing? What kind of life have you lived? It's a long story. If I wanted to hear a long story, I would be at home. Each time you hunt, you must take a life. And so you must thank your sister or brother for their gifts as they return to the Great Mother. I see you. Your spirit goes to Ewa and your body stays to become part of the people. Thank you for these gifts. This way you let her ascend to the ancestors. Remember that, and do not waste the gifts you receive. The gifts? Right. The hide, the meat, you know what to do with them. Ah, Nefika will show you. Go on. You do not need me to hold your hand.
see you. Your spirit goes to Ewa, and your body stays to become part of the people. Thank you for these gifts. Tiny sky people, they will wear our spears like feathers. Oh, you have outdone here yourself. Here we go. I am worried, so and you should be too. I go. Come to the sky people who are everywhere. Me, have you? you know that. Now, now, you know how I love your food. But I stand by what I said before. It is not exactly art, is it? I swear to you, one bite of yogurt. It is the sky people who are driving them from their home. <laughs> this is a simple recipe. A kametire. I have some meat from my hunt. Nefika said you... You sent this forlorn miscreant to bother me? Everything is a joke, as usual. She said you're the best cook. Ha ha ha! Ah! The child knows how to charm. And honesty from you, Afika. I suppose that is typical of her tactics. She thinks flattery will get her everywhere. Come, come. Leave the grump for later. Now we turn to more serious art. Is there something wrong with your home tree? Go well with this. Etua said it suffers. Ah, the Kingnor are uneasy. We have provided for them since their flowers closed, but their numbers are too many. Katnad so would prefer Etua to so focus all her home. energies on them. But I think that child does her best. Now pay attention. Katnad should see you still have some Natvi skill. And I should like to Grand see it Dad myself. Like this. Everyone says they can cook, but no one does it like me. Good. 
Now show Katnat how you have mixed your colors with our own, just as your people once did. Do not be afraid of him. His bark is worse than his bite. I will follow shortly. Again? How did they ruin this again? We are not some brawling Zeswa. Etua should know better. Fresh herbs bring the dish alive. I hope Father stays longer this time. These berries right. Come to better yourself. Stay sharp, young one. Did you gather more fresh Can you save me from something of a headache? Alemun and Neyan, our lookouts. Both of them are sharp and capable. A shame they can never see eye to eye. This most recent disagreement, however, it sounds serious. Neyan especially sounds so tense now. They could benefit from some Sarantu diplomacy, surely. The war cannot be avoided, for hunters especially. Been out by the waterway valley. So that is why we have so much fish to eat. What a bountiful journey it Nefika has had her way. Now you look more like the Saren do we remember. The loss of your people pains us. We valued their counsel, but we know you are not here to offer their wisdom. The sky people, the resistance fights them, but they can't do it alone. This is why you have come. You stand in the heart of our home tree. Its warm embrace. Even you, lost one, must feel it. And you ask me to bring war here? No. They bring war with them. Please. We, Arana, here do not seek conflict. And yet you goad us, desperate for a fight. Do you remember your family? A little. My mother. Her smile. Her warmth. Did you see her die? 
Did she smile at you then, helpless, desperate to reassure you? Have you seen Ewa's light leave someone you love? Well, you certainly made an impression. Gatnat is not easily rattled. Be careful, my own do. I wasn't trying to anger him. Keep your chin up. Pay a visit to the very top of our tree. Our Tzahik is back. Sahewu. I'm sure he would be happy to help. He is so eager. Eager, yes. But perhaps not the